So today, instead of telling you guys on how to get money, uh, although you could definitely use this to make money in glitchy ways, I'll probably talk about that a little bit later or in a different video another time, but this is a glitch on how to just completely freeze time only for your character, only for you. If you go into online, if you go to a public lobby, you will not be able... Other people's time will still be the same, so it might be night time for you, but then daytime for them because you've frozen the time. But I'll get into more details about that later when I am actually in free roam with other players. But for now, let me just talk to you guys about how to actually do the glitch. So what you want to do to start this glitch is you can be anywhere on the map that you want to be, just so long as you can access your interaction menu. So once you have then opened your interaction menu, like here, go into director mode and anything that may pop up here while you're loading in, into direct mode, into where I'm going to load into now, or loading out of here, just accept anything as it shouldn't be a problem. Simply go into here then, and then go to the bottom and enter direct mode from this stage. Don't change anything here, don't do anything here, just enter direct mode and you should be fine. Now I'd just like to say that whatever time of day you loaded into direct mode, that's the time of day it's going to be when you actually load into it. So just before it was night time and it's still night time direct mode. This doesn't really matter though because I'll explain later on how to change this. But what you then want to do is go into your interaction menu and go to settings at the very top of the uh, interaction menu. And then at the very top you'll see time of day. Set that to whatever you want to be. So for me it'll be midnight and then just click freeze time. If you look in the bottom right hand corner you will see freeze time. Now don't yet go into online like I was about to do. Go into game and then load an old uh, save file like you saw before. I did make a save file just to be sure that everything was okay. Now for this I will just be showing the times speed up there just so you guys know that I'm not doing anything uh, that may change anything and if you guys have any problems you can just let me know in the comment section down below. But then once you load in to an actual single player game you then want to then just simply spawn in no matter where you are just spawn in and it should still be nighttime or whatever you set it to. And if you want to check this, just bring up your phone and then just look at it for a little bit and then just see if the time is frozen. So for me, you can clearly see it says 111 and it isn't changing. The time should change every two seconds, so it should be 112, 113 every two seconds to change. So if it doesn't do that, then you can go into online, but don't go into a free roam game. Go into an invite only lobby first and then when you've done that, you can decide what you want to do. So again, I'm going to be showing you guys me learning into GTA 5 Online. Obviously, it takes ages, so I'll sit here for a while. You can go, go to bed or something. Just wait while GTA loads. And then when you wake up, you should be almost done loading GTA 5 Online. But then what you should then happen is you should just go to where your character already is in GTA 5 Online. And when you spawn in, it should be some sort of time of day. It might not be midnight like you said it to, but I will show you a workaround for if it isn't that. So what might happen is you may have set it to midnight like me, but then when you load into online, it's going to be daytime or it's going to be sunny outside. It may not be the middle of the day, but it's still going to be sunny outside. So as you can see for me, the time has changed from single player to online. It's changed by like an hour-ish, but... The time is still frozen as you can see i'm walking around everything's fine but i'm in an invite only lobby now if the time is absolutely fine for you then that's great you can just stay in this lobby if you want but if you don't then it's very simple all you then have to do is if the time that you are at you are not satisfied by that time you want it to be different say if it's midnight and you want it to be daytime then just simply go into online and just find another session now, you can do this if you want to just get into a normal lobby, or you can do this if you just want to change your time. You could load back into a single uh, a private lobby, but that obviously takes a little bit more time, so you may fuck up the, t the time a little bit more. So, I just recommend finding another lobby, because it wouldn't really matter too much. But now, when you load back in, you will notice for me it's still night time, but when I show you my phone, the time has changed by a little bit. Not a lot, but it has changed a little bit. I believe whenever you find another lobby, it should increase, 
by about 30 to an hour. 30 minutes to an hour it should increase by. But if you don't want to be in a lobby with people, say, then all you have to do is just test your NAT type or go into another lobby by yourself. If you want to know about that, there's another video just popping up right now. If you want to find out how to get into a lobby by yourself. But as you can see, I just showed you my penthouse at the time and now I'm outside showing you the time and you can clearly see it is frozen. But the one thing that will happen is not everyone else in your lobby will have this. For them, it might be day. For you, it might be night. If you're really interested, you can ask someone in your lobby, hey, what time is it? And they will probably tell you a different time. But that is going to do it off for the end of this video. If you guys did enjoy, then I'm just going to leave it off with the with this pussy of a, well, supposed tryhard who tried to get my bounty and, uh, well, completely failed because uh, he shit on the Oppressor Mark II. As you see, I went to passive mode, failed, and then just jumped out of my car. But, anyways, I hope you guys did enjoy this. If you did, be sure to leave a like and subscribe. All that shit I always beg for. There will be a video coming out soon where doing this glitch will help you. This glitch will be helpful. So, well, if you want to earn money real quick, then uh, I'll suggest, you know, just subscribe to the channel. Just do it, all right? Please, have I, have, have I sold this channel enough to you already, all right? If you're still here after six and a half minutes, you've gone above the average view time, so you might as well just subscribe now and just watch some other videos. Thank you. I'll see you in another video. Take care, and I'll see you guys later.